Hello, this is Richard Miles with Board Game Authority, and today we're going to be looking at Keyforge, or more specifically, some of the rather unfortunate names that have been generated for the Keyforge decks. Well, uh, let's get right into it. Uh, here we have Wang, the Suddenly Bruised. And we have uh, Gregaciously Unsanitary. We have the Mortuary Rascal. Uh, the Spirit that Places Capacitors. Okay. Uh, it that wickedly supports taxation. He that curiously hugs potency. The cat burglar that doubts litigation. We have a window washer uh, named Tasha. The villain that digs up porridge. That's a uh, pretty good one. The woman who headbutts sharks. Now, that's not unfortunate. That's just awesome. Uh, the specialist that classifies sharks, that's like a legit thing. That shouldn't be in a uh, fantasy deck. That's like people actually classify sharks. Uh, let's see. Uh, she that punches elephants, that's just not nice. Uh, Cardinal, the basically philanthropic, okay. Uh, the tidebreaker of the fanatical hive. Tomb Dirk, the teacher of socialism. Captain Switchblade. Uh, the Zoo Record Keeper. Uh, come on, let's see here. The Screaming King of Fleetshire. That one doesn't seem that really unfortunate. I mean, yeah, that's a... The Emperor That Pays for Boys. That one is pretty unfortunate. Uh, Titan Flayer, the Farmer of Racism. This is probably the most famous one. Uh, this is one of the ones that, that I think was uh, first discovered and is uh, often quoted as like, Ugh, what's going on here, uh, Fantasy Flight? Yeah, the farmer of racism. The boy who basically headbutts heaven. Okay. The soldier that vaporizes space Valhalla. Again, that one's kind of cool. That one's, one's kind of cool. Alright, and, uh, and now we're back at the beginning. So... Those are some of the names that have been randomly generated. The uh, first couple of questions that come to mind is why are words like racism, like why were they not filtered out of their huge da database of, uh, of words? Somebody dropped the ball, it seems. Fantasy Flight has said they will uh, try to reconcile this. If you have one of these unfortunately uh, named decks, you can get in touch with them and they will, I think, send you, you know, you will send your, you know, uh, inappropriately named deck back to Fantasy Flight. And I think they'll send you two decks as a replacement, I think is what I heard. Um, so if you, if you get one of these, um, you know, kind of kind of bad decks, uh, just get in touch with Fantasy Flight. Uh, if you have one of these decks, let me know. I'd love to hear about it. These some of these are are just unfortunate, but some of them are rather hilarious. So let's uh, keep a list going of these. Until next time, game on.